They know each other's personal secrets and the best thing is they are happy to share it with you to make the other one look bad. They're just the coolest kids I've met and this power was the most fun I've ever had. I still haven't stopped talking about them. To continue the fun, we decided to have to interview each other. And that took good to three hours because we didn't stop talking and being mean about each other. So we're going to do something really fun. We're going to continue. Um, before we are getting the magazine, we're going to do a quick demo. No, give me that one. Give me that one. Okay, so next like question. Who's more likely to break into a dance move on the set? Oh, it's uh, who's more likely? Who's more likely to steal a prop from the set? Me. Uh, who's more likely to get into a fight? <laughs> okay, no arguments, sir. Who's more likely to write a book? Me. Who's more likely to read a book? See, both hands. No, they're more likely to read bazaar. Um, who's more likely to save a stray animal? Uh, who's more likely to fall asleep at a party after 12? This is, I can't do them in a fight. This has been too harmonious. Uh, who's more likely to have a secret stash of snacks? <laughs> okay. Uh, who's more likely to buy a fancy car? Uh, I mean, I have a deal. Who's more likely to survive a zombie apocalypse? Apocalypse. Yeah, that is a word. You. <laughs> You'll fight the zombies off with the half of a zombie. Who's more likely to become Prime Minister of India? Can I answer that question? Yes. I think it's me. I'll definitely survive a zombie. Like a cockroach? Uh, yeah. There are the only people who can survive in this. Uh, Thanks for that. Okay, who's more likely to be the Prime Minister of India? Who's more likely to be the next Prime Minister of India? Neither of us. Oh, she's not like. I think you need to steal your card back. I don't mind though. I might. 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 I Um, we, have time, we have time for three questions. Shifa is going to moderate that. One second, one second.
Yeah, I remember everybody from the Harper's team being there. They're very involved personally, which is really nice to see. And uh, we had a great time working with Tarun Vishwasal, the photographer. Uh, also shot our actual short <laughs> poster campaign. The first poster yeah. campaign for our film. So it was nice reuniting with him and we, uh, I mean, he kind of completely left it open for improvisation and he had a very, very nice day of work. So, yeah. So. We have seen a couple of pictures from inside the magazine. So we could see your six pack abs. You know, oh, what's the secret? Show them now. We were the secret now, they're not. Um, I, well, I mean, I, I like to do a lot of movement, and uh, I'm a dancer. So uh, I think it's basically just uh, being active, working in it. Uh, yeah, try to be right. Oh yeah, that, that's the most exciting part, honestly. I mean, I, she's pretty much a pro at photographs already. I, on the other hand, was just poking around and we managed to get some nice pictures in the process. But I was also given the criticism that I am too smiley and having too good a time. <laughs> While she's going, whoo, keep out. <laughs> so I had a few things to learn in the process, but it was great. I mean, I, I really had a lovely time. Please come and watch it. Yes, please. Our, our film is out on the 20th of July, which is the reason for all of this attention. Uh, and I really hope it's uh, more than worth it. Uh, we've really put our hearts and souls into this film. It's a wonderful story and uh, I think it will resonate with audiences all over the country. So please, Aiga, Marie, please, 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 that was a nice question. How social you all are at a party and welcome kind to of people. <laughs> <laughs> um, well, I think uh, yeah, I'm I think I'm affable, but uh, I'm not uh, I'm not much of a social being. I don't do parties. I think we both prefer one-on-one private interactions as opposed to parties. Uh, uh, as you all know, we are having a great time working with each other. But who are the people that you like to talk with in the future? So funny, we were just asking each other this question a few hours ago. Yeah. That'll come to you also, but I'd like to hear from you. I think there's a lot of people uh, I would love to collaborate with, uh, ranging from filmmakers to actors. Uh, do you mean uh, actors in specific? Um, I mean, there's, there's so many actors I would love to work with, there's so many actors that inspire me. Uh, I'd love to work with my brother if I ever get the chance. Um, I'd love to work with uh, so many senior actors who are in my production, from actors like Nessie is um, I love Vicky Koshal's work, uh, Rambir, uh, Razeer, Alia, Deepika. Uh, I mean, there's so many wonderful actors, you know, I mean, I'd love to be happy to work with any one of them, as long as it's the, I fit with it. Adaptation of Sarah Chayra, actually. A very hit film. And uh, recently, actually, in few years ago, it's come. When you approach for this film, what was your reaction like? Or maybe it was through Dharma production that was the reason also? To accept this? Both, both of you. Um, sir, uh, of course, Serat is a film that is very uh, fresh in people's minds. It uh, only released in 2015. Uh, it did so well. Uh, you know, it was uh, loved by people uh, unanimously, and uh, uh, you know, it, it did very well to the producers and the film. Um, so, of course, it's a, a, the first thought that crosses the mind is that this is a very big responsibility uh, because this is a story people feel very strongly about. There's a very deep attachment to the story, so there was a feeling of responsibility. But I think uh, when Shashan. Uh, shared his ideas of adapting it and not remaking it, the fact that he wanted to set it in Rajasthan, he wanted to make his own film, do it through his own perspective. Uh, and that's when I really realized that his intention to make the film was 
uh, pure. And um, and I was very happy to be a part of this. And I feel like I think Sir Shashank are, uh, are attached to it. I, I feel that they have so much knowledge and experience. Uh, you know, this is Shashank's third film, and he's made two very successful films before. Bharat Sir, of course, has, has all kinds of experiences over the years. So I was very happy that uh, I got a chance to collaborate with them again. Jami, you um, share. My last question. No, yeah, same thing. Jami has to speak on the same thing. Uh, you know, it was no brainer for me to get on board because uh, firstly it's a big deal to get an opportunity like this, to have the chance to tell a story that's as special as uh, the one in Sairar. And it's such an iconic film and uh, you know, they've done such iconic work, I think both the actors and uh, even Nagraj ji. And it affected me so deeply, like I'm sure it's affected everyone who's seen it. Um, so yeah, I was just excited to live that journey and to, you know have a try and telling the story from a different perspective, from Shashank's perspective, who I think is uh, you know a lovely, uh, an amazing filmmaker who has uh, you know his own style, and uh, he's more than anything I think he's one of the best people that I've ever come across in my entire life, and one of the things that I'm most thankful for is having him as my first director and as a mentor and as someone. I look for guidance. And so the chance to work with him and Kara and have his guidance and support and Ishan and uh, just how exciting the character was. She was so different from the exploratory culture. Um, so yeah, it was, I was excited to do it. I'm very happy to take in there. Was I would think you put it back in Uh, you know the airline is not going to wait for them. Um, buy your tickets. Buy your tickets. Not for the airline. <laughs> 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 well done. Uh, I think we need to end this. Uh, I think we need to do the one. Uh,